Sierra Foothills is known for its gold history, the American River, and its spectacular views, as well as its hiking trails. But the Forest Hill Bridge is also known for something much sadder. KCRA 3 photojournalist Mike Carroll met up with a husband and wife who have now committed themselves to offering healing at that bridge. My husband is a reader and he said, well, it's the fourth highest bridge in the nation and it's, you know, really beautiful and let's find a spot to see. And I wanted to maybe see if I could see the American River and I can. The Forest Hill Bridge, nearly half a mile long and over 800 feet above the American River, completed in 1973, half a century ago. You have magical moments like this, looking down at the water and experiencing the, you know, the joy of and beauty of the earth. This is also the place where, as of December 2022, 98 people have been confirmed of having taken their lives, a number that has only grown. And as you can see, some people put a lot of time into these. Which is why Dan Craven and his wife Nicole come to the Forest Hill Bridge frequently. This one says, no one escapes pain, fear, or suffering. Yet from pain comes wisdom, from fear comes courage, from suffering can come strength, if we have the virtue of resilience. Putting up notes to people in the worst moments of their lives. They come from people all over the country. They, they send them to us. Putting up five to 600 notes at a time. It's tragic and it's horrible and people need to be aware of so many people who have issues and have disabilities that we don't know about that we cannot see. Laminated to protect these notes, these messages, these pleas against the weather for as long as they can. The only thing I can say is it's devastating. Somebody in that state of mind to take that final step, if you will, is just, I, I can't even comprehend it. Thousands of notes a year. There was a gentleman that came out here on um, Easter Sunday. He had planned on jumping, and he came out here to find one lonesome note right in the middle of the bridge. And he turned around and he went home, and he, he contacted some of the Notes of Hope people. And as far as I know, he's still doing well. So this is the last line of defense. At the Forest Hill Bridge, I'm Mike Carroll, KCRA 3 News. If you would like to add a note to the bridge, you can send it through Notes of Hope Suicide Prevention through their group on Facebook. And if you need to talk to someone, call the National Suicide and Crisis Lifeline. That number is 988. Someone will answer your call 24-7.